Hi friends, this is Sudarshan and welcome to Iversoft India, your ultimate resource for learning anything. In today's screencast, we are going to take a look at Inkscape document properties. Last screencast, we have seen that if I want to change dimension of this object, let's delete this object. I want to create a rectangle this is a rectangle and uh, if I want to change dimensions of this object to say 100 by 100 then I will have to put it here 100 and again here 100 but uh, is it exactly 100 what is the unit for this if I see here units it is mm because I have selected this unit as mm if I open a new document new inkscape document this is the new Inkscape document okay and if I see here just a minute okay. if I see here the default unit is pixel anything whatever I draw here will take dimensioning based on pixel size I can change it here to mm say 50 by 50 by 70 sorry 70 so this is 50 by 70 uh, oh sorry it is 703 uh, 50 by 70 this is 50 height by uh, sorry 50 width by 70 height rectangle now if i want to create a circle a circle now what about this circle uh, i'll have to say select tool this is also mm but what if I want to keep this constant mm so that I can do with document properties it is a it is pretty important that's why we are covering it go to file and go to document properties here you can see page size normally it is a4 us later or legal there are multiple sizes select uh, size you can customize size based on your requirement keeping width and height unit mm 210 mm by 270 uh, 297 mm default unit i can make it mm or meter or inches or feet anything anything can be done here any unit can be applied background of our page it is absolutely transparent because it is zero here transparent rgba this is code for our background i close this uh, show page border because this border we is visible because it is showing the border if i disable this border will go okay so uh, right now I, I will enable this border okay if I click clear click here border on top of drawing then mm, it will look like this but I don't think it is required in this case okay I'll disable this border shadow this is setting border shadow border color so this page tab is important other guides grades snaps color management scripting you can do it with yourself oh, so this is important okay in next screencast we will take a look at how to snap these objects with each other like snapping okay so have a good day and see you soon